Yo, what is going on, everyone? My name is Nick Lepre of Osmo.com, and in today's video, I'll be giving you guys my three best bets for March Madness tonight. Inside of today's video, I'll be breaking down my three favorite props, as well as going in-depth into why I believe each of these props are going to end up as winners. But before we could get on into things, I would like to ask if you are new to the channel and you do end up enjoying today's video, to please make sure that you do hit that subscribe button down below. And while you're down there, whether you are new to the channel or not, please make sure to leave a like on today's video. It would help us out a ton. And if you would like to follow me on Twitter, please do so at NotoriousFNTSY. So without further ado, let's get into my three best bets for tonight's matchups inside of March Madness on March 17th. 2022. So we begin with my first best bet, and that is going to be Justice Hill of Murray State going up against San Francisco tonight over 11 and a half points currently set at minus 115 on Caesar Sportsbook over on our website we currently have him projected to score 14.4 points in tonight's game meaning that this bet has a 68 expected win percentage on the season he is currently averaging 13.2 points per game over his last five games things haven't been as hot as he is would have just hit the over 11 and a half points in just two of five games but the reason at the end of the day as to why I believe he will be able to go over 11 and a half points in tonight's game is because I feel like this is going to be a high scoring game and I feel as though Justice Hill will be playing in over 35 plus minutes in this game and if that is the case again I think there's going to be a high scoring competitive matchup that Justice Hill should easily be able to smash over 11 and a half points up against San Francisco tonight my next best bet is going to be Stanley Umude of the Arkansas Razorbacks going up against Vermont tonight over four and a half rebounds for Mr. Stanley currently set at minus 108 over on FanDuel on our website we currently have him projected to get 5.4 rebounds in this game up against Vermont mean that this bet has a 63 expected win percentage on the season he averages 4.6 rebounds per game and in the last five games this bet would have hit in three of those five games in a game where I very much believe that Vermont is going to look to shoot a million fucking threes in this game I think they're going to be firing rapidly from the beyond the arc and I think that is going to lead to him being able to easily get over four and a half rebounds if this was set at five and a half rebounds I understand that we only have him projected to get 5.4 I would still like the over at five and a half so at four and a half definitely going to be hitting on over four and a half tonight for him up against Vermont but before we get on into my final best bet of today's video I'd like to let you guys know about odd shopper on there you guys can be making your best bets in 30 seconds or less odd shopper offers hundreds of bets daily to give you guys an edge betting NBA props. You can also bet NHL props, NFL when the NFL season is on, and college basketball props. With expected win percentages and ROIs included, Odd Shopper uses the same DFS projections we use over here at Osmo to filter out the best bets available. Odd Shopper now also features a parlay builder and an arbitrage tool to identify risk free, guaranteed profit bets that you guys can make across multiple sports books. You can find the link to Odd Shopper in the description of today's video and start making smarter bets today. Again, please make sure that you guys check out the link down below in the video description. My final best bet going to be on the screen right now is going to be Oshai Agbachi of Kansas. Again, if I botch, butcher, not botcher, any of these guys' names, I apologize. Sometimes I get guys' names wrong, so I genuinely apologize. That's why it's on your screen. That's why it's in the timestamps as well, so you guys can read the name out correctly if I pronounce it wrong. Of Kansas going up against Texas Southern, over 19 and a half points currently set at minus 110 over on DraftKings, over on Odd Shopper. We currently have not projected to score 21.7 points in this game, meaning that this bet has an expected win percentage of 61. On the season, he currently averages 19.7 points, and in two of the last five games, he would have hit the over. I personally believe that this game is going to be one that Kansas is able to control. And since he is the leading scorer on the team, and this should basically be a cakewalk for them, I think he could easily get 20, 25 plus points in this game. So that's why I like the over 19 and a half for him. So thank you guys all so much for watching today's video. If you did end up enjoying, please make sure again that you hit that like button as well as that subscribe button and check out Odd Shopper. Link down below in the description. I love you guys all so much. I hope you have a great rest of your guys' day. And as always, goodbye.